Noah Centineo was rejected by Lana Condor. We'll tell you each side of the story and if Noah has ever considered dating a fan. Oh my God, like this video if you totally date Noah. Like, 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 that's me. I'm Yeska and you're watching The Daily Report. Ugh, Noah Centineo edition, marry us. It's been two weeks since all the boys I've loved before dropped on Netflix and Noah Centineo has gained millions of followers, but he's not gonna let this internet boyfriend fame go to his head. In an interview with ET, he spoke about how this part is so life-changing, but that he wants to keep his inner space the same. Our humble little bae. <laughs> He's so sweet, like a little chocolate. And if you're hoping that someday Noah will go from the internet boyfriend to your real boyfriend, then um, maybe you have a chance. When asked if Noah would ever date a fan, he said, quote, I don't close any doors totally, but probably not. Because then it's more of an infatuation with like a position more than like the person. Look, he said, probably not, not definitely not. So I'm pretty sure there's a chance. <laughs> right? However, if you're trying to slide into them DMs, then you're totally out of luck because he does not check them. Trust me, I tried. I even called him. He didn't pick up. And even people like Noah are not immune to one of the worst things life has to offer. Rejection. Before filming To All The Boys I've Loved Before, while in the audition room, Noah asked Lana Condor to run lines and she said no. Noah told E! News, I was like, oh cool, fine, I'll just die here. However, once they finally read together, Noah said it was perfect. But I think the question in all of our minds is, why the heck did Lana turn him down? Look at his pretty face. According to an MTV News interview, she said she didn't want to be distracted. She spoke about how she saw him walk into the room and she thought he was gorgeous. And she said, quote, and I was like, not today. And I kept reading my slides like, I will not be distracted. I will not be distracted. I will not be distracted. And who's to blame her? He is so distracting. He's on my phone background right now and I just look at my phone all the time. Shh, don't tell my boss. After booking the role of Lara Jean, she said she saw his name on the list of the guys she was going to do a chemistry read with and she got nervous. She wondered if he remembered that she rejected him and she even thought he might try to sabotage her. But in true Noah fashion, as soon as he walked into the room, he was kind and welcoming. She said, quote, to this day, like, I think he's the greatest guy ever. So it's not hard being his co-star at all. <sighs> yes. It looks like the Noah train will not be slowing down anytime soon with another Noah Netflix film coming out next week. We cannot wait to see more, but we wanna know what you guys think. Was Lana justified in her rejection? Let us know in the comment section down below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to Awesomeness TV. I'm Yaska, and once again, Noah's in now. You're lonely. You want a girl with a cool last name and first name. Just 